I can't help but notice that Russia keeps taking a special interest in helping colonized nations fight back against their colonizers. Russia understands that the enemy of your enemy is your friend. And if you're seeking to supplant um, the global empire of America, start going to its victims. Start going to the countries um, that uh, America has been... Uh, participating in their exploitation and then you liberate them so that in, in, in some way and it may be you get 50 years it may be you get 100 years but you get a friend who will fight with you against those western countries like America um, who you're wanting to topple Americans Americans need to wake up and pay attention to it because they don't really realize they don't have they don't hold the global position that they used to. That within it's very easy that within a generation or two, um, that even Gen Alpha could see the true realization of just how third third world America is, and the fact that Americans are being floated on borrowed money. And once that is sh once that's shut off. And Americans can't borrow money to continue to float themselves along. Americans are going to look like what America really is. And it's unfortunate that people don't realize it. And it's because they've been gaslit and manipulated for so long that they literally, their reality is shaped by lies and conspiracy theories and it's shaped by conspiracy theories and lies to the point that they seek to reinforce that through de-educating future Americans by burning books and doubling down on white supremacy when white supremacy is a weakness. And Russia knows that. Russia knows that American white supremacy is a weakness. Therefore, it is... Um, Seeking to make friends in the world amongst those that were injured and marginalized by colonizers and white supremacists. You think this is a stretch? Just give it a few years. And with the way, with the speed at which uh, Russia is moving in the world to gain um, more than just a stranglehold, but domination it may be only a couple of years because I don't, I don't think Americans are realizing uh, the damage, the true totality of the damage that uh, Trump, what Trump has done uh, to America. But I think when their electricity gets shut off and I think when they, when they can't bring food in uh, and they're struggling because, well, everyone in America has, has guns. I think they're going to know then. And I think they're going to realize it. At that point, it's going to be too late. 